Hi guys, this is Doug Stewart here at the Ski Rack in our newly located Thule Center, now on the bike floor at the Ski Rack. So guys, with the bars and the feet changing this year, there are a lot more options. Four bars and four feet for lots of different cars. So really knowing what feet you want to use for your car becomes really important. The new wing bar is going to work a lot like the Aeroblades we've been used to for the past couple of years. Um, this channel is going to be something where you don't need to remove the diffuser, you don't need to put holes in the diffuser. When you are putting accessories that go into the channel, you can basically put that hardware into that channel, position it where you want, and when you remove that rack, bike tray, ski carrier, whatever it might be, you pull that stuff out, you're not going to need to replace anything, so that's going to be ready to go. If you aren't using the channel to mount things, there are still brackets that will come with things like the upride, things like the pro ride, where these brackets are made to go big enough to get around your bigger, fatter bars. Um, so that'll be more versatile. So whether you're using an arrow blade, whether you're using a new wing bar, or if you have an old square bar or the new square bar with the channel, you'll have brackets that can also work on that. I have a car where one has a wing blade, one has a square bar, and I'll use this bracket system to go back and forth with a particular bike train that works great. Some cars are gonna use the new clamps. This is the new Evo clamp. This grabs the same way the old Traverse 480 did and still does, um, and there will be new fit kits to go with this. It's a little bit nicer footprint. It fits and engages with the car a little bit better. So that will be your new go-to setup when you do have a clamp style foot still locks on the cover when you get your optional locks, looks nice, works really well. Some cars that use what's called a podium foot or a flush rail system are still going to use the 460. So that 460 foot podium foot is still going to be in the line for this year in 2019 um, and that will still be an option. So that hasn't changed, it will be changing in the future, but currently you're going to use that foot for this year. So we've got different options there, whether you're running that raised rail or you're using the old 450 or the new uh, Evo raised rail. If you're using a podium foot that's either a fixed point or a flush rail, you've got that option. And then we have a traditional, what we call a naked roof. You're going to use a new Evo clamp. There may be fits where you can still use the old 480 Traverse. So that's where finding a Thule expert to kind of know which one to use. Maybe your car isn't a 2019 or 2020 model. Going back a couple of years, that old Traverse foot might still be the best option for you. So Thule's guidance online will help figure that out. And then us with the knowledge we have using all these feet with lots of different cars, we'll kind of figure out which one makes the most sense for you.